Hi students, how are you? Today we are going to learn about genetics. This video is the first part of genetics learning materials. Can you describe what these pictures? Yes, those pictures tell us about two different family. Each family has different physical characteristics, different types of eyes and skin color. Can you mention other differences? Anyway, the children have similarities with their parents. Why? If you want to explain all of those questions in scientific way, you have to learn about genetics. This video will explain about the definition of genetics, the structures in genetics, and some terms in crossing. First of all, what is genetics? Genetics is the study of genes and inheritance in living organisms. This is an important person in genetic development. He is Gregor Mendel, father of genetics. He was the first man who studied how traits are passed down from the parents to the offspring. He created Mendel's laws. Now, let's talk about the structures in genetics. The smallest unit in our body is called cell. Cell has organelles. The most prominent organelle is nucleus. In the nucleus, there are genetic materials called chromosomes. Chromosome is built up by a long double helix structure called DNA. A small section of DNA that contains the instruction of specific characteristic is called gene. Gene carries information that determine a particular characteristic in organisms. For example, Based on this picture, gene control so this girl has bright skin color and straight hair. Nucleus in human body cells contain 23 pairs of chromosomes. Its chromosome is paired with its homologous. Chromosomes are differentiated into two types. The first type is body chromosomes or autosomes. We can see from this picture, autosomes are chromosome number 1, 22. Autosomes determine the physical characteristics such as hair color, eye shape, and skin color. The second type is sex chromosomes or gonosomes, chromosomes number 23. Gonosomes determine the sex type. In this picture, the gonosome consists of two different sizes of chromosomes. We call it as chromosome X and Y. This is the gonosome in male body cells, so we call these back chromosomes as male karyotype. This is the female karyotype because gonosomes has the same size of chromosomes, we call it as XX. Male body cell is diploid cell because it contains 23 pairs of chromosomes. We write the chromosomes as 22AA meaning 22 pairs of autosomes plus XY, meaning a pair of gonosome with different size of chromosomes. Male gamete is haploid cell because it contains 23 chromosomes. There are two types of male gametes. The first type is written as 22A, meaning 22 autosome plus X, meaning one gonosome X. The second type is written as 22A plus Y, meaning one gonosome Y. Female body cell, a diploid cell contains 23 pairs of chromosomes. We write the chromosomes as 22AA, meaning 22 pairs of autosomes, plus XX, meaning a pair of gonosomes with the same size of chromosomes. Female gamete, a haploid cell, contains 23 chromosomes. There is one type of gamete which is written as 22A or 22 autosomes plus X. So, the body cell contains 23 pairs of chromosomes. It is called diploid cell or 2N. Gamete contains 23 chromosomes. It is called haploid cell or N. When we talk about Mendelian genetics, we always discuss about crossing. A genetic cross is a purposeful mating of two individuals resulting in the combinations of genetics materials in the offsprings. This is an example of crossing in human. 
This is an example of crossing in plants. We cross a red fruit with a yellow fruit of cherry plants. You have to know the terms in genetics cross. The terms are allele is a variant form of a gene. It is symbolized by alphabets. Example, big R for red fruit or small r for yellow fruit. In this crossing, red fruit is called dominant trait because it is symbolized by capital letter. Dominant trait will cover recessive trait. Yellow fruit is recessive trait. It is symbolized by lowercase letter. Recessive trait only appears when there is no dominant trait in the genotype. Genotype is the genes responsible for a trait or genetic makeup. It is symbolized by a pair of alphabets or allele. Example, big R, big R, small r, small r, or big R, small r. Phenotype is the visible results of genes or appearance. Example, red fruit for big R, big R, or big R, small r, and yellow fruit for small r, small r. Homozygous organism is organisms which has genotype with same allele. Example, big R, big R, or small r, small r. Heterozygous organism is organism which has genotype with different allele. Example, big R, small r. Next, parental. Parental is individuals as parents of the crossing. Example, in this crossing, red fruit and yellow fruit plants. Gamut is a structure that carry inheritance factor from parents. Example, in this crossing, there are gametes which carry big R or red fruit traits and gametes which carry small r or yellow fruit trait. Filial. Filial is the offspring of the crossings. Example, in this crossing, the filial is red fruit plants. Okay students, that's all about genetics background and terms in crossing. Please wait for the next video about monohybrid and dihybrid. Thank you for your attention. Stay healthy and God bless you.